here we are in no man's land I've sold up my house in the big smoke and decided to go off grid uh, semi off grid this land was going cheap said it had a little old farmhouse on it figured it was a start so I bought it pretty excited heading out there got my Kenworth I don't know what's out there, but we'll see. Got a bit of money in the bank left over from the sale of the house after the purchase of this block. Pop it right down. I said, turn right after the big rocks on the right. There's a lake. Oh, there it is. Yeah, it's supposed to be next to a lake or something. Looks pretty nice. Home sweet home. Looks a bit run down. As long as it doesn't leak too much. And there's a bed. Oh, it's got a kitchen. It's got a bath. And a festy looking bed. It's even got a loft. What's up there? Some old stuff. Might have to do a bit of... Uh, old house archaeology there. Whoa, we have light. What else have we got on our farm? Sheep pasture. A couple of old trailers. Beaten up old tractor. And a plough. Jeez, even got flat tyres. Some old plough. Horse paddock. I'm liking this sheep and the horses, that's for sure. This looks like a wood chipper over there. A couple more trailers. What's that? That's a loading wagon. Oh yeah, for the horses, for the straw. Fair enough. First things first, I should have a look at the size of the block. 37 there. Okay, so these trees are... let's go for a little run. These trees are inside the block. Hence the wood chipper, I suppose. We've got some nice pasture there. A bit of pasture over there, but not much. The horse stable looks like it's at about the top end of the land. I'm guessing. And just to fill you in, obviously this is my farm now, my property on Farm Simulator. Um, I'm planning on kind of blending a few games. Um, American Truck Simulator, where I, I drive an orange Kenworth K100 on American Truck Sim. And probably we're going to Call of the Wild since we're in the wild. And, um, and if I can sneak some flight sim in somehow, I may attempt that. So we'll see what happens. First things first, though, I need to fix this tractor so that we can um, use it. Okay, tyres fixed. Now, what's the old engine? Wonder if she'll start. Don't really know what I'm looking at. We'll just jump on and give it a go. See if it'll turn over first. Yep, well it moved. Give it another shot. No. Sounded like it was almost going to kick over. Let's maybe have a look at this little diesel pump. Maybe it's it seized. There we go. Oh, I'm insisting on climbing up this tyre. Give it a bit of a whack. Try it again. There we go. It's alive. Alright. Well, working tractor. It's kind of getting late in the day. Shop shuts at 7. Maybe I can get up there and pick up this ATV before they shut. 
set up old, old trailer. And head on up to the shop. Here we go. Gateway between no man's land and the outside world. Alright, uh, put a lot of this down. Disconnect it. Oh, old faithful. Well, we'll see how faithful she is. Perfect. We'll grab it in that camo colour too, that looks pretty awesome. Yep, and 50 horsepower, that ought to do. It's not like I can tow with it. Thank you, Mr. Invisible. First things first. I would love to know how I can default that to off. Beautiful. We'll get back home. Call it a day. Lovely. around the place We've got the neighbours before it gets dark oh yeah probably shouldn't have gone over that drawbar there 
Oh, go have a quick burn around before it gets dark and we'll check the joint out. And maybe I should have bought another block. Maybe if we earn a bit more money here, this would be a nice spot to put paddocks in this bit. Bit of timber on that block. Alright, so, horses, like oat and straw and water and hay and sheep like grass, there's plenty of grass, which means I've got the hay covered. Okay, grass are plenty. I need to plough a paddock and plant oat. And that'll give me straw and oat. Uh, water, let's just run over here. Uh, looks like we've got some kind of plumbing going on. Must be poor water or something. I assume they've done the same up on the sheep paddock. Quick look, yep, same there. Okay, so what are we good for? Got a loading wagon for when we harvest the oat. So, A, I'm going to need a baler. Might even just hire that when we need it. Um, I've got nothing to seed. We could buy a seeder. Got nothing to fertilise, nothing to spray lime. Okay, let's write a bit of a list. I need lime slash fertilizer. I need something to spray herbicide. I need seed, a cedar, and some seed for that matter. And we'll need a harvester. Which we'll have to loan, I'm guessing. I'll see how cheap the cheapest one is. But, I don't know, at this point I think I might just hire it. Harvester and uh, Baylor was the other thing. Um, Baylor. I guess round bales work. I don't necessarily have to have square bales because I'm gonna. I've got a loading wagon, so I don't need a thing to shred the bales. I don't need to make any TMR or anything. I don't know if I can use round bales. I guess I can. Guess we'll find out. But that will do for today. So that's the plan. Bit of cross game simulation going on, and uh, I'll catch you later. Gonna go in and make myself a copper lovely clean kitchen hope you enjoyed that please like share subscribe and hit that notification bell catch you soon